This is the model of a human brain. And um, this is the front of the brain. This is the back of the brain. This is the brain stem. The eye sits right here. And the tumor for Jeffrey was located actually in the back of the brain where controlling for vision occurs. If we look at the inside part of the brain, brain is two hemispheres. I'm going to remove the left hemisphere and look at the right hemisphere. Um, and you can see this part of the brain controls vision. And in Jeff's case, the tumor was located right next to the part of the brain controlling vision. Previously, we would have just gone ahead and removed as much of the tumor and some of the surrounding brain that was infiltrated by the tumor without knowing exactly where vision is, and we could have compromised vision. In his case, during surgery, we used electrical activity to activate those parts of the brain around the tumor, map out what those electrical activities did to his vision while he was awake and talking to me, find out which part of the brain is controlling vision, and after that we found out where those areas are, we were able to remove the tumor by avoiding those important parts of the brain so his vision remains intact after surgery.